one tradition that we had in our family was that we'd get played to bed by uh, one of our parents playing the piano. And it would usually be Get Along Home Cindy uh, because it was Get Along to Bed. And the thing that encouraged us to obey was that if we didn't get there pretty quickly, the music would stop and we wouldn't have music to play us to bed because they'd only play a limited amount of time. There was music uh, a lot for a lot of things that we did. When I got out of high school, I, was, I didn't know what to do, so my mother made a, an appointment for me to take guitar lessons. And uh, so I, I acquiesced, and it turned out to be Charlie Bird. <laughs> Charlie Bird taught me my first C chord, and uh, we got along fine. And he, he had a, a country, uh, hot country guitar picker came and visited him once during one of my, my sessions, one of my lessons. And they jammed for five or ten minutes during my lesson. That was the best part of it all. <laughs> but I didn't last much longer than um, my time with him because he quit as he was starting his performing career. And I took up with a, a classical guitar player who made me play the notes the way they were written. And uh, I said, I just don't want to do that. So from then on, I was... <clears throat> I was kind of self-taught. I was a very curious person. I mean, I'd see people playing. I remember when I went to see Earl Scruggs the first time, I left his banjo playing, and uh, there was one lick that I especially liked on one of the records that he did. And in person, he didn't do it. And I said, and I walked up to him after the program, and I said, why didn't you do the lick that you do at such and such a time? And he just kind of looked at me like, what is this, you know? <laughs> All the other fans were there just saying, you know, I love your playing and so forth. But here's this funny-looking young kid, you know, obviously he's from the city, asking him why he didn't play it like he did on the record. <laughs> and very shortly after that, I really appreciated that he didn't play it exactly the way he played it on the record because he'd think up all kinds of new licks too and I'd, I'd travel 50 miles to go out and see him just to hear him play the lick a little bit different you know it's thrilling 